Hey everyone, we're back with more FF12. We are going to be working our way through this area. Also makes it harder to steal because now I have somebody else draining the HP of enemies. I got two succulent fruits from that. Look at that. I also think this is the first area where elementals start showing up. And elementals are fucking scary. Easily some of the scariest enemies in the game. Dude with hay song, apparently. Where are they getting some? Okay, he's carrying a potion. It's kind of funny that I haven't gotten any of the stronger heal spells yet. It might be up here. Nope, not there. Okay, that's fine. But there is this one. Wrecked. Mmm, succulent fruit. Then we get a map of the Ogre against the Sand Sea. Which, guys, when I said this was a large map, I wasn't kidding. It's pretty gigantic. We're gonna go up and around. Back down. Over here and end up back there. That way we have a chance to find another one of the, of the uh, treasure chests that are in the area. this fuck. Couldn't steal from him. He's gonna cast sleep on me. That missed. Couldn't steal from him. I did get 27 gold for graffiti. How much HP does this fucker get? 90 XP. So, the XP's not too bad. It's not the greatest. It's kind of remind me of, um, the Voth in FF14. In fact, I'm pretty sure these are the Voth in FF14. Oh, I got an echo room, so... Oops. I think I got obliterated.
Oh, I stole a pebble. Sick. Oh yeah, that's one of the downsides to having the monographs, is all the monsters in the game will now drop pebbles. If you have their matching uh, monograph. Pebbles are shit. Oh, I stole a Yensa fin. Interesting. I don't actually know what Yensa fin does. up here though. Oh, that's the thing. Uh, I think we're start gonna start seeing exploding treasure chests soon. Got a potion. So if you like exploding treasure chests, this is the place to be because you're probably gonna see it because I'm gonna open every treasure chest because it's just the way I am. Vector, when you're playing RPGs, do you purposely go the wrong way just to get all the treasure? Good. You are a true RPG player. Awesome. Thank you for waking me up immediately, though. Petrify. That would have been a really cool time to actually have Petrify work. You are a true RPG, -er, sir. to the south first. These guys primarily drop uh, potions, but there could be some value in sealing from them, because I don't know what the Ensa pins get us, but uh, Alright, I guess Bosch didn't want that one to be alive. They might kill it before I'm able to. Yep, see dude. I think there should be one treasure chest around here. Could be, but there's a- oh, there it is. Uh, yay, I stole a pebble from it. Yeah, they're gonna kill it before I get a chance to steal again, so... Two earth stones. Fourteen gil, excellent. Alright, we could go down there, but we're actually going to head north first. And then from 
here. It also gives us a chance to revitalize some MP on our on our run here. Hey, it's uh, P. Hurricane Yensa P. I didn't want to steal from him anyway. Apparently these guys carry gold on them, or gill on them. Next there we go. This is gonna have more people to kill. More good stuff to steal, I think. Might actually be the um the Namyansa that uh that has the uh, embroidered tippets in it. Or whatever the uh, item is. I would actually prefer double life points, but uh, or uh, license points. Uratanians. As you can see, there are a ton of these fucking Uratanians and things. He's dead, Jim. At chain level 19. We're gonna break that chain, though, because... Well, that's just how we do, I guess. Because we got enemies down here that are not... ...of the, uh... ...Uratan variety. Instead, we got... ...these guys. Got a water stone. <laughs> oh, uh, we can steal from B over here. <laughs> got a lot of HP. They also have regen. Can steal. They will probably kill it, but in case they don't, no, nope. no such luck stealing from the spear tower. Gonna put region on himself. <clears throat> Damn, he casts that fast. What the fuck? Den Bang. These things don't really have anything worth stealing. Though they do drop, um... Actually, they don't drop anything worth one. Although, I could poach them to get Argyle on, but... Itty Gill, alright. There should be another... So there's a cave here. We can actually go into that, um, but we're not going to because it, uh, the enemies in there might be a little too strong for us, but I'm not worried about that. It's just, we already got a huge area to explore. There's no point in exploring a cave right now. We will be going in there later though, as there is something worth getting. 
Ah, but we're not gonna do that till we get to the Osmond Plains. Take that! Wait, did Vaughn level up? I actually don't know. No, he hasn't. Okay. How much do we need to level up, actually? 5,717. Okay, well, we're gonna be using this game for a little while yet, then. Uh, there's nothing up here other than that enemy. I just wanted to beat him up because it's worth it. Alright, so our next treasure chest we're looking for is actually gonna be just down here. Steal it. Nope. We're gonna steal from it. Hopefully. Damn it, Vossler! Ow. He's knocked me back. Got your potion, bitch. I like to keep my party member uh, close to full health. It feels nice. So Vossler is actually using great swords, which is the weapon that I want Vaughn to use, but unfortunately, we cannot do that because we do not have one. Fortunately, the first great sword you usually get in the game, usually, is uh, one that you don't actually need the license for. If I remember correctly, it's not a bad weapon either. This is not a great weapon. That's not bad. Yeah, there's a treasure chest down there. Oops. Can you guys not use dark modes on me, please? That'd be super. Actually, I'm just gonna cast gear. I'm just gonna cast gear. So, Vector, what'd you get up to this weekend? Got any plans for this week? I'm gonna be not streaming on Thursday or Friday. Thursday, that's normal, but Friday, I'm gonna be away. There's also not gonna be any stream Saturday or Sunday, as I am away for those weekends as well. Friends for a friend's birthday? Cool! Yeah. I got to go to a, a barbecue at uh, McRonchie's place, uh, or McFrosty's place a few days ago, or last weekend, and oh my god, it felt so great to just get out and hang out with friends again. A Yensa? What the heck is this? I want to steal from this. Don't kill it. I got a Yensa scale. How does that sound? No, I want something else. Oh, another pebble. Oops, no, both here I want you. Wait, right here I'm gone. Yeah, it felt so good to go and hang out with someone. Also. Uh, I found somebody that gets decent audio on the Discord uh, to host movie nights for. The next movie night we're going to have is going to be Spider-Man 2. With uh, Tobey Maguire. And I will let you guys know when that's going to be. Um, probably at some point uh, when we're playing Sky uh, uh, Skies of Arcadia. Which, again, I gotta go and get that set up, but I'm not too worried about it as we're not that close to finishing this game. Yeah. 
I should probably uh, attack. That'd be good, right? Getting lots of pebbles, unfortunately. I'm gonna go over here first, because this leads to another dead end. Hey, look at our room. Might even talk oddly into joining us for a Sunday movie night, so that uh, or a Monday movie night, so that he can uh, see the amazing Spider-Man. Because apparently he has never seen it. Yeah, nothing got destroyed. Handkerchief. Handkerchiefs are great. They clear off the oil status. Oil kind of sucks because it uh, makes you weak to fire. High potion. Okay, one of my guys is probably going to run over and set off that, uh, that trap. Alright. They're so close. But they didn't. That is a wyvern. Wait, am I strong enough to fight that thing? Yeah, he's not too bad. All right. He's coming over. Come on over, buddy. Oh, Boston knows telekinesis. I stole a firestone from him. Oh, I'm going to miss a lot. Hang on. Alright, so this guy's a chance to drop uh, linen caresses. Caresses? Your attack fire? I know I wouldn't be able to steal from uh, JH there. He was getting his ass wrecked. One of these days, I should do an FF12. Uh, no shop run where I'm not allowed to like buy anything from the shops. I can only use stuff I find, like that Z Will Blade I just picked up. All right, so one of my dudes here is probably gonna set off this trap as I go through it. That could be a fun run, right? They're probably also going to set off this one. Told you. There does not appear to be a treasure up here, which is unfortunate, but it be what it be. Might as well heal Vossler as well. While we're here. Okay. So. That's too bad. The treasure chest I was looking at there, um, that could have spawned there, had uh, has a chance to have a uh, a new weapon for Bosch. 
Four times, fuck. Hey guys, there's another trap. Should I go just, just go step on it? I'm not gonna go out of my way to fight those if they're just not in my path. This one here is really close, so we'll beat him up. You getting close to where you dropped this game? Now, Faye, did you play the, um, the this version or was it the Zodiac Job Edition? Zodiac Age. Also, welcome back, Faye. How was class? New version, Zodiac Age, okay. I'm pretty happy to be playing this version. You were hot? I believe it. Alright, there's actually a treasure chest that spawns there that has a new dagger in it for both here. At least I think it's a dagger. Again, unless they kill it. Oh, well, you got obliterated. 28 go, alright. So, treasure chests have two common items, or two items that they can give you 50 50 percent of the time if they give you an item. They also have a chance to give you gill, and if you have a diamond armlet on, they have a chance to give you something else entirely, usually a knot of rust. It's uh, like a 95% chance to get a, nine, uh, a knot of rest. <laughs> These guys are using katanas though, I, wanna, I want that. <laughs> Not much luck stealing from these. Oh, if you guys are interested, this is the uh, look of the map for this area. Hang on. I'm gonna heal up. This is the area we're going into right now. It's just a lot of circles. I already know where the treasure chests are, so I'm not going to be running around all of them. But there are a lot of these little fucks here. Oh shit! Did it just disappear? That big fireball right there? That's a scary enemy. That's a very scary enemy. If you cast magic by it, it goes to aggro. On the flip side though, if you can manage to steal from it, uh, you can get some really good stuff. try and steal from it. And then we're gonna run the fuck away.
Woo! We. Oh my god. Oop, I want you to use that one too. Oh my god! They are taking their sweet time, you're right. Okay, so. Guys, I don't know if you saw what I stole there, but, uh. I don't think it's a key item. Where will this appear? Blue. I stole this. Searing flames adorn this fiery jewel engraved with an exquisite depiction of a Salaman Antite. <coughs> So, that's um, a pretty rare item, I, I would say. Let me see if I can find you uh, exactly what this gets you, what it's used for. Salaman, hi son. That was a 3% steal rate, by the way. Alright. So, it's used in creating the following bizarre item. Uh, a gun, actually. And uh, you only need one. So, I'm gonna save state here in case that thing is still aggro. When I go back through that gate. Because we're not losing that item. That was a 3% steal rate! And it could still be angry at me on the other side of this wall. <laughs> Whew. That was rough, though. Oh, uh, good time to do this, actually. 